Surprise, surprise, motherfucker! The king is back! Well, you know, this fighter, as he makes the walk tonight, is going to be looking to lean on the speed and the footwork in this particular matchup. Got to keep the hands high, right? You got to stick and move and get the hit off the center line, given the power that's coming back. But I'm just not sure that the opponent can match the quickness. Exceptionally fast on the feet. Very good at using angles to set up his offensive attacks and very sound defensively as well. So, as the reach advantage, figures to be able to use it here tonight. This is one slick striker with which to contend. exciting here DC the founder of Jeet Kune Do one of the founding fathers really of mixed martial arts Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said I want to be a fighter it was the speed it was the charisma it was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special and tonight he's gonna look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done and if you hear the phrase drillers make killers right i mean that was bruce lee in a nutshell he felt like practice yes. would make yes. perfect nobody trained as hard as the great bruce lee bruce lee ladies and gentlemen bruce effing lee ready to go and so are we for our main event and now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Herb Dean, our referee Ready. for this one. Ready. Do it. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training. And I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his speed, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. Oh, nice kick. Oh, a nice straight punch there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but defensively as well. Very good read there. Well, missed on that one. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. Oh, doing work with the jab. These boys are going at it. Oh, big left hook there. Oh, that's big. Well, blocked that punch. Oh, working the body with that kick again. A little single collar tie there. Oh, some separation. Nice sidekick. Man, how 
good is his right hook counter? Just over three minutes to go. Nice liver shot lands. Leg kick is true. Trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, it's just tremendous. You, you see a fighter with a high fight IQ following a game plan, and it's working. Stay strong. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Perfect execution on that team. Oh, a huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. They're so evenly matched. They're going to the pattern. Unable to connect with the right. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, beautiful straight left hand. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to start add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack, not being one-dimensional, not headhunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now, and it's starting to show itself. Good combination there. 45 seconds to go here in round one. Land that beautiful jab. Let's get busy with those hands now, man. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, huge strike lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Oh. Waning seconds here of this opening round. Oh, great block there. Oh. Five minutes in the books. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we are, early round two. All right, so here we go with our next round. DC, you are known for having one of the higher fight IQs in the game, and I would put him on that list after what we saw in terms of the body work there in the previous round. He did a fantastic job of mixing up his target. Not as going to the body, making that investment into forcing a mistake later that will allow him to chase his finish. Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Big right hand. What a beautiful leg kick that landed there. But he needs to check one of these kicks. He has to discourage him from throwing this kick over and over again. Just out of range with that strike. Relax, relax. Ooh. Lee's got a 
Drew starting to appear on that right side of his body now. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. Touched him with the strike there. Oh, yes, it is a lost start in mixed martial arts. Not just the jab, but the double jab. I mean, a beautiful double jab. That thing's throwing right from the chin, too. Well, he's had next to no answers for the body shots here tonight, and now some redness really starting to develop on that side. We're starting to see the damage. We're starting to visibly see the effect that all these body strikes are taking on this guy. He's got to do something different. And he's got to be very careful because look for his opponent to go over the top now that he set him up. Man, as he landed the high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So we got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Nicely done with the kick there. His leg is hurt here. You can see him limping a little bit. Well, it didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kicks would be the key tonight, and they sure have been. Oh, massive kick, Lance Flush. Oh, nice knee. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Two minutes now to go in round two. Oh, flush knee to the body. He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. So he continues to land a high volume of strikes. He talked to us a lot about pace and pressure, and he has certainly kept up his end of the bargain. I mean, the cardio is fantastic tonight. He is pushing at a level that we have not seen him fight before. This is shades of Colby Covington, Max Holloway, those guys that can fight all night. He is showing you that he has done the work in the training room, and it's on full display tonight. Lands a good series of kicks here. Straight punch there again, been there all night. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow up. Beautiful shot lands the leg there. Picture perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is gonna be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Looping left hand misses the target. Let's take a look back at some of the highlights, DC. And if you like Muay Thai, you like knee strikes, that was the round for you. Yeah, that was a great round. You can see how well-versed he is in using all weapons that are available to him. He hits elbows. He uses punches, kicks. But his knees have improved to the point that he can dictate and control a round by using just those. Ready, fight. Ready. Third round underway. Next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good back and forth action in the previous round. Yes, it wasn't a far fight. It wasn't two guys throwing the kitchen sink at each other. But you did see times when it came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. Is that a huge strike right there? I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Move those hands. 
swing and a miss with that punch by Lee. Shot to the body is plus. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of oh. oh! Oh, big shots getting through! Oh, that's a big right hand that got through. Big knee to the body. Oh, perfect timing on the Superman punch. A swing and a miss by Lee. Rips the body there for good measure. Oh, nice straight left. Lee's left leg is damaged now. You can see he is limping. It was that last kick from his opponent that appeared to do the bulk of the damage. Oh, a huge block there. Just missed with the left there. Three minutes to go. Oh, bone on bone, shin slash foot, right to the skull. You see why I'm a commentator and not a fighter? You see why? Yeah, those are fun. The big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that fit. Leaves all sorts of bruised up on his body. That is going to hurt something fierce tomorrow. As he gets close, he's not in the kicking range. He'll suddenly he'll change his stance. We have crossed the midpoint of this fight. Tags him with the uppercut. Kick lands. Oh, nasty cut there, right on the bridge of the nose. Both guys appeared to land there. Sidekick. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money at fight's end. These guys are going to have to dig deep. They're both hurt. They're both hurt. You expected it, though. You expected a close fight. You did not expect a war like this, though, where both guys, from the moment they said fight, went forward, got in each other's face, and just beat each other up. It's been tremendous. So the blood really starting to flow. Every time that area gets targeted, that cut's getting worse. It's getting worse and worse. And you see the blood starting to come down. That is when you start to watch the fighter to see what type of effect it's starting to take on him, whether or not he's reaching for it, whether or not he's confused by where it's at. You gotta start to watch his reactions now as we go forward. 60 Come on. Huge block there. Oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or run. He's, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Big. Oh, elbows up top. <laughs> Able to check that kick as well. Oh, he is black and blue all over, maybe even dealing with a fractured rib, but the body strikes have been the in this one. It feels like we're getting close to his stuff. We're getting very close. I mean, I, I can't imagine he'd be able to take many more. We may be one body shot away from this guy just not being able to stand. Toughness on full display. He got beat by a better fighter than that. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, back to the stools for 60 seconds. That gives us a chance to re-rack some replays, including what we believe is the strike that caused the cut on his nose. Yeah, beautiful strike that lands. 
causes this cut, opens him up on the bridge of the nose. It's not a bad cut, but if he continues to go forward, his opponent Ready is a fight. sniper. And Ready. he's going to keep hitting him in that Good. same spot. Move your head. Really choose the times in which you're going to advance to try to get to this guy. You got to be careful, though, because he is so good at picking his shots. And, of course, it's hard to know the extent to which that has compromised his breathing, but that corner was fired up. They want him to be more de defensively sound as this fight continues. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Nice one, two there. Trying to establish that jab once again. A huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. Oh, he's been working hard defensively. Kick block there. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Just out of range, though, with it. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. It got checked. Oh, you can start to see him limping a little bit after one of those leg kicks, so better make some adjustments or this fight could be over. You don't want to show it. That's why you see fighters, when they get hurt, they smile. To be limping out there tells you how damaged this guy is. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Going to the body now with that hook. Well placed there by Lee. And continues to pepper the body. Great commitment to the kicking game. Oh, nice. Nice. To land right there, his opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Side leg kick. Oh, how technical is that? Nice straight punch. Under a minute now to go in the round. Remain in the round. 
Man, looks like he's trying to set records. Oh, you gotta start to look to finish him now. Oh, whoa, gold win. Not a fight so far. All right, so the round is over, and you see some obvious bleeding now. Looks like the cut is on the nose. Yes, it is. Cut Man will try to get in there and shut it, but of course, as soon as he absorbs a strike this next round, that thing could reopen. Certainly bears watching here moving forward. All right, back to the stool, and he is officially swole, and I'm not talking about muscles. He is swollen up top. I mean, he looks bad. It's because he was too stationary. He was on the receiving end of too many big shots. He was beat up, he was battered, he was bruised. And look at all the swelling. It shows that he has taken Ready far fight. too many. Ready. Fifth yeah. and final round. Pretty good job blocking that attempt. Just missed with the leg kick. Push kick there to the body. Nice straight punch there. Right on the button. He's got to start moving his head. He cannot take this many shots to the head. Oh. Gets caught by that frustrate punch. Nice job by the offense there. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. Lee's taking aim at that cut right now and hard to blame him, right? Might as well continue to target that area and see if you might get a referee or even a doctor to intervene here. Try to establish that jab. These boys are standing right in front of each other, just kind of going at it. It's okay, keep going, keep going. It's just turning his hip over into the leg kick. Nice right hand. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. There's his jab. Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can find at his opponent and hope that he can force a mistake and overwhelm his opponent to try to get a finish. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, man. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Two minutes now to go on this one. Leg kick lands, my favorite strike. Let your hands go. Let those hands go. Oh, perfect execution on the low kick. Out of range with that one. Both fighters throwing heat now. Oh, two strike lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Well, you know, Rogan's pissed he missed this one. We are witnessing an instant classic. Back and forth we go. Both fighters have been on the cusp of being finished, and both have exuded a ton of heart. Yeah, they both shown heart, courage, 
ability, technical skills. I can't really tell you how these two are still in the fight with the damage that they both are exhibiting on their face. That shot blocked by Lee. The kick is there to the body. 30 seconds to go here. Lunges forward with a left there. 20 seconds left. Lands a nice leg kick. 15 seconds. Lee's able to switch his stance here. We'll see how the defense responds. What a fight! 25 minutes turned in. All right, so a lot to like over the distance of that fight tonight. Clearly, we think we saw one guy win the fight and largely got it done with the striking. Yeah, he got it done with the striking. And that's exactly what he's known for. He's known as a guy that's so comfortable whenever he's in the stand-up. And that showed tonight as he truly outworked his opponent. The official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 49-46. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! So the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the martial arts legend tonight. This man, of course, has had no shortage of challengers since coming to the UFC. 